got to believe in what you are doing. If you do not believe it, I will know. I will feel it. And I will know that you're putting this up here kind of like a paper tiger. And I will go through it because I believe in my shot. Do you believe in your shot? Do you believe in your block? Because if you don't, the truth will be revealed very shortly. You're gonna, it's gonna cave in and it's gonna go, my shot's gonna go like this. Or if you do believe it, we're gonna neutralize each other, you know, at best. So that's how you should think about when you train. And when you teach your students, make sure they have a belief system in what they're doing. Because if they don't believe it, what are you doing it for? Just find whatever works for you. Don't chase things that aren't there. Don't do techniques that aren't realistic or just simply not there. There are many of them. I look at YouTube and I'm like, whoa, this guy actually used this? Hmm. So keep in mind, keep it real. And again, whatever you do, you've got to believe it. You've got to understand it to the point and believe that you can pull it off. And the only way you get that way is you practice and you have a partner. Hardest thing you'll find over time is getting a good, long-lasting partner. Because life happens. Things change. Guys, you know, get married, move away, have a job, pass away. You know, one of my best partners, favorite partners, passed away when he was in his 30s. Unfortunate, but these are part of life. So whenever you have someone who you train well with, cherish it. It is sacred. It is that time you are allowed to have with a person to train to your best ability. And again, believe in what you do.